but we have been given practical tools and ways to stand against this invisible enemy, whether it's called COVID-19 or whether it's called financial loss or whether it's called I lost my job or whether it's called I have cancer in my body or whatever it is that the enemy is attacking us with, all of these are tools or ways or postures that we need to stand. Number one, understand that sickness and disease does not come from our Heavenly Father. Jesus paid the price for our healing and our health and our wholeness, spirit, soul, and body. Therefore, if Jesus paid the price, he's not going to put it on you. You have to have that down deep in your heart and in your spirit. Number two, we exercise the power and authority that we have been given. We take the keys of the kingdom of heaven and we stand. And having done all to stand, we continue to stand using our power and authority by speaking and declaring and stopping this thing. Number three, we humble ourselves and we look to Jesus. We stay hidden. We stay hidden in him. Number four, we worship. Worship is one of the most powerful tools that we have against the enemy, and he hates it. So just dance on, dance on, and celebrate the Lord. Number five, we trust and do not allow fear to enter our hearts because fear is not of God, it's of the enemy. And number six, we stay rooted and grounded in love, and we stand on the rug of peace. Amen. Those are really good, solid uh steps or or good solid things that we need to take to heart as Christians as we're facing the, this virus right now or we're facing difficulty ahead. 